Do you know the first person to use the abbreviation sign, cos and tan? He is Albert Gerard, a French mathematician and musician born in France in 1595. In 1626, he published his first book on trigonometry, where he used the abbreviations of sine, cos and tan. He was also the first to propose the fundamental theorem of algebra that an equation to the power of n necessarily had n roots. I think, therefore I am. Do you know where this quote came from? This came from a French scientist, mathematician and philosopher named René Descartes. René Descartes is known as the father of modern philosophy, father of modern mathematics, father of analytical geometry. His major contribution in the field of mathematics is the rectangular coordinate plane or the Cartesian plane. He explained how the location of a place could be measured by the use of x and y coordinates. How René, Descartes, René Descartes, Descartes discovered the Cartesian, the Cartesian plane. He was staring up at the ceiling, he saw a fly. He wondered how he could describe the fly's position on the ceiling. The Cartesian plane was born. By using this plane, describing the position of an object became easy, specific and accurate. Thanks to René Descartes. He has, he been, has described been described as the greatest, as the greatest might, have might have been in the history, in the history of, mathematics. of mathematics. Do you know, Do you him? know him? He is Blaise Pascal. Blaise Pascal. Pascal was a 17th, was a 17th century, century French, French mathematician, mathematician physicist, physicist, and philosopher. He is known, he is known for, the for the invention of calculator, of calculator syringe, syringe, and hydraulic, and hydraulic press. press. Some of his Some works, of his works in, mathematics in mathematics are Pascal's, are Pascal's triangle, triangle, binomial, binomial coefficients, coefficients, and foundations in the theory, in the theory of, of probability. Did you know, the strongest earthquake recorded in history happened in Valdivia, Chile in 1960. The city was hit by magnitude 9.5 earthquake resulting 1,655 people killed, 3,000 injured, 2 million homeless, and $550 million economic damage. Are you wondering how they measure the energy released by the earthquake? Seismologists use magnitude scale in measuring earthquakes. The mind behind this invention is Charles Francis Richer. He is an American physicist and seismologist. He was the first to develop the logarithmic earthquake magnitude in 1930s. An earthquake is measured by the Richter scale, using the formula R is equal to log of I over I sub zero, where I is the actual intensity of the earthquake and I sub of zero is a baseline intensity for comparison. For better understanding, here is the illustration of the Richter scale. Women are awesome not only today, but even in the past. You are actually facing Hypatia, the first woman mathematician in history. She is a Greek mathematician, astronomer, and philosopher who lived between c. 355 and March 415 in Alexandria. She was trained as a mathematician by her father, then, and eventually became the leading mathematician of Alexandria. She was a popular teacher and lecturer and led the Neoplatonist school of philosophy in Alexandria.